WrestleMania weekend, day three. It is Friday here. We're walking the streets of Dallas. We got Miguel up there. We got Justin. Yeah. We're heading together. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the intro. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, we gotta do that eventually. We gotta record the intro for the Boston All this V3 with Justin. But we're heading to get some grub right now. We'll find a spot. Hopefully. Check this out here. This beautiful waterfront. All these sprinklers coming. Check that out. We got a statue. We got a bus. Is there a worker in there? <laughs> Look at the statue. It's George Bannerman. George Bannerman Dealey. What a guy. He's a legend in this state of Texas. <laughs> to the Hard Rock, again, what we got here, some Twisted Mac with that chicken right in there, look at oh, that, yeah. Miguel got the same thing, he's got like the fried chicken on the mac and cheese, that's the fried chicken, <laughs> <laughs> Justin with those ribs, oh, wow, side, over under, full rack, side of mac, side of mac, oh, yeah, over under, how many are you going to, I got the burger, over under, you're going to have to help me, <laughs> <laughs> let's dig in, Miguel with the Hooters. Hooters. <laughs> it's a little oh. We the boys! <laughs> There's a Paramount Tower. <laughs> We're outside Wild Bills, the Western store. Ryan copping that cowboy yeah, hat. Cow He's a true Texan right now. The toothpick. <laughs> they all grab hats, except for me. Yeah. I can't do that gimmick. I'm not from Texas. Look at that. I gotta do the backwards hat. Look We're from Boston. Right there. Oh, there it is. They got it. Yeah. Reigns and Triple H right there. It's funny how we got. We told the guy we had like, yeah, I know exactly what you want. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone knows Tig. He's from around here, isn't he? <laughs> <laughs> Jerry Lawler's up there. Yeah, see that king shirt? Random. Yeah. Mark for himself. He's like at the grassy knoll where they say JFK was assassinated. Or was he? It's like 3.45 in the afternoon right now. And it's from when we went up to the hotel to now, it's like totally different outside here. Right. It, well, you couldn't see any blue before. Now it's blue skies. And Sun's out. Yeah, I was like wearing this rain jacket, really like ready for rain. It's <laughs> we freezing when we came out earlier. Yeah, now it's, it's, like, hard it's like a totally different day out here. But uh, we figure that we're going to head over to the Evolve wrestling show. So we can get like GA. Yeah, it's general mission, 25 bucks. Starts at 4 o'clock. Yeah, Zach was trying to do like the same thing. Yeah, he didn't have a ticket either. So we're just going to head over and get in. And we just scored those Ring of Honor tickets from our friend, Real World Champ, for tonight. So we figured, like, why just sit in the room for, like four hours I just find like something to do so we figured we'll just go to uh, Evolve which should be a great show it's supposed to be uh, Will Ospreay's match going on so supposed to be a big one right this is like a match that everyone's looking forward to we aren't really that into like the independent wrestling anymore as we used to be but right. I mean it's gonna be so, some awesome the, live wrestling most of the top talent that we like we came up with went to WWE like Aries Steve Jenner obviously now we gotta learn these new guys. Yeah. So here we go. En route. Twenty-five dollars general admission. You can pick any spot you want. Found this little area right here. Nice little seat out here. Got a nice view. It's a cool venue. And a ranch.
So we are back here at the Hyatt Regency here in Dallas in our hotel room and we decided to do this in front of the mirror just because of the obvious beautiful lighting in here. Right. Justin's I mean, marking out over this. Just the lighting, this is just a great location it's perfect, to right? film videos. <laughs> this is perfect. Right. But we just wanted to quickly talk about uh, the Evolve show that we just witnessed. Uh, we're going into it. We didn't really have much expectations other than just seeing some great live wrestling. Right. And that is exactly what we got tonight. We, we got like uh, two, uh, two and a half hours at right. least of uh, just great action in the ring. Uh, there wasn't really any point in the show where I was like, oh, this is kind of dragging on. I, right. I actually just enjoyed the whole show. Me too. Uh, just these two matches stood out to me especially. That was uh, a TJP match yeah. versus... Uh, Really fate ricochet. Right. And then uh the the match that everyone wanted to see, Will mm -hmm. Ospreay versus Zack Sabre Jr. Right. That was that match was the night. <laughs> yeah, that was <laughs> the jump. first time that we ever saw those guys. We had even no idea what they even looked oh, like. So just after seeing that match is like I'm a fan. Definitely. <laughs> and we'll they definitely put on. Yeah, we'll be seeing them soon for sure, like in NXT and stuff. No joke. And Down especially, uh, like you mentioned too, with Ricochet. Yeah, I think he's the uh, hottest free agent in wrestling. Right. He has to be. Yeah, we have guys, everything. We haven't seen him in a few years, and it's just he's just gotten better, right? Like, in ring, and I feel like we're gonna see him in the stadium in a couple of years, maybe next year at a Mania. Right. He's gonna be wrestling in front of a hundred thousand, never mind yeah. five hundred or so. Is there. he with Wale? Like uh, he, yeah, Wale? I think he is. The right. gifted athletes. He yeah, is, then. along with like Uha Nation, because uh, uh, Wale helped Uha get signed. Apollo yeah. Cruz. Yeah, and helped Rich him Swan sign. helped him. Rich Swan. So I guess NXT. Ricochet is the next one up. Hopefully. I would say. I heard like rumors like Miguel was saying. I think that he was like we're trying to get out of his contract. Oh. So he, he's obviously trying to get out there. I feel. Yeah. Because you know, Triple H must be interested. Yeah. So that was the first time that we ever watched Evolve. For twenty five dollars for that general admission ticket, cannot go wrong. Just oh, no. great in ring Wasn't action, bad. at all. And we're gonna keep it going because right here in our hotel, it's going down. Ring of Honor wrestling. We haven't seen Ring of Honor in a while either, so oh, it's gonna be great. Minute. I'm excited for it's that main event. Tonight. We get to see the Motor City Machine Guns here in just a little bit. Young Bucks. Oh yeah. And we got uh, Kyle O'Reilly versus Matt Sydal. Right. Evan Bourne. Yeah. It's gonna be a crazy match. Right. We definitely like everyone else wanted to see NXT, but sometimes when you slack on tickets. Tickets, you end up getting shut, shut out, up. and you're not going to pay $300 for a single ticket, so no way. Ring of Honor, a it's little... Still, it's going to be a great show. Right. You can't go wrong, but right. that's why it's so great this weekend. We have so many options for wrestling oh, yeah. events. Yeah, that's NXT like... NXT or ROH, you can't go wrong That's with that. like been the theme of the weekend, is just independent wrestling and wrestling in general right now is just killing it, as we've seen right here tonight with Evolve, and now we're going to go downstairs, and we're going to see what Ring of Honor... Right, two different venues too. That just shows that there's yeah. demand for it. Yeah, huge crowds, probably both shows. Definitely. Yeah. So here we go. Ring of Honor, let's go. Thank you. 